I am Nadia Samdani from Bangladesh and uh, we live in Dhaka and we are collectors and we have an art foundation called the Samdani Art Foundation and we also host the Dhaka Art Summit which is the single largest platform for South Asian art. And I am Rajiv Samdani, uh, Nadia and I, we founded the Samdani Art Foundation together. In the collection is quite eclectic and we have a wide range of you know you know starting from sculptures to sound to videos um, drawings all kinds of work and um, we have mainly we have we call it we have two collections so one is the foundations collection which is the South Asian collection and the other is our personal collection which is an international collection which is our journey as a, as collectors and the South Asian collection is, you know, we collect very strategically, you know, very focused. Our foundation, uh, mainly we support and promote artists from the region. And uh, we sort of, and you know, one of our biggest event of the foundation is Dhaka Art Summit. We call it a research platform. And, uh, you know, one of the challenging thing about uh, South Asia that, you know, very, uh, little number of galleries in India are representing artists. There is only one or two galleries in Pakistan re represent artists. Otherwise, you know, the representation concept, uh, uh, like gallery representing artists, the concept is not there. So it becomes very challenging for everyone to discover about the art from the region or especially the contemporary art scene. And when we started our, uh, like started collecting, one of our idea was to collect from the region and then we sort of figured out that you know that you know the region is suffering there is very little support and we ourselves don't have much clue so that is how you know to support and promote uh, the region or to discover and learn more about the artists from the region we uh, started this foundation and now we mainly support artists from bangladesh and also artists from the region first of all like you know i think initially not Based in Bangladesh, of course, there are some challenges. Of course, like we have high uh, duty on tax, and you know, when it comes to logistical support, all these things, you know, there it is quite challenging. And it's not only Bangladesh; I think it is in the region. But one thing I must say, I think you know, culture is in our blood. You know, the Rabindranath Tagore, uh, uh, the famous uh, poet who was the founder of Shanti Niketan and I think the Indian art history took its new turn from there. And you know, Bengal, Calcutta and Bangladesh, we were, we were all one Bengal before. So I think, you know, culture and everything, it's in our system. So, uh, you know, even last Thakar Art Summit, we, yes, we had 70,000 people in three days. And of course, those challenges are there and challenging situations, you know, it makes it even more interesting. Well, what we do, we... we I mean, like we said, like our international collection is our journey. But you know what we try to do? We have some artworks or some artists we have in mind that we'd like to collect. So at the beginning of the year, we kind of like make a target that, you know, these are the things this year we'd like to acquire or have in our collection. And then you know, and, take and, it from there. And what Nadia said earlier, that we have two collections. So one is our South Asian collection and one is our journey uh, as, as a collector. So the South Asian collection is very focused. So we have a group of uh, 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 colleagues, our curator Diana Campbell Beaton Coach is also involved with this collection. So that is something we are building very strategically. So someone like you know Anish Kapoor who is known as British artist but you know he would fall uh, under South Asian artist in our collection. So and then the other collection that is our journey as a collector so we have artworks from all over the world and then we also like to collect we play around with our own collection so this time we just finished our third rehanging in the house we live in and you know we have ex uh, displayed uh, the work of uh, Paul Clay and this uh, Pakistani diaspora artist Pakistani modernist Shemza's work together because Shemza was actually influenced by Clay so you know, so 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 uh, the personal collection. What what she said that yeah, you know, the beginning of the year we sort of look at our collection and we see that okay, what we want to get. So and another thing we don't uh, believe in. We don't want to like you know sort of split art by the region. Yeah. We think art is a global language. 
So, and we look at our collection and then see which, which artist is doing what and then we sort of make a list. Another thing just wanted to add that, you know, we are uh, building up a space uh, in Silet. So it will be also for public, so it will be a permanent place where we will have collection and we will also have uh, a sculpture park there. We have just started working on it and few of the artists has already like you know uh, uh, finished their work some of them visited the site so that is the next thing you know we are working on and both of us we are member of uh, Tate, uh, south asian uh, acquisition committee i also co-chaired the committee and uh, other than that, we are also with the tates international council and we are involved with few other museum and institution i think it is very important and uh, for us it is also a learning experience you know you also get to learn and see that how institutions is thinking about the region you know and and uh, for dhaka art summit also this coming edition i think we have five uh, museum curators who are uh, will be curating exhibition for dhaka so you know this is amazing that while they're actually curating uh, exhibitions they're also doing research on the region and it is sort of a win-win situation for all of us. So mu museum can get to do their research about the region. At the same time, region can see these museum quality exhibitions, and especially in Dhaka, and we're very fortunate. For us, we, uh, like, you know, rather than, like, of course, collection is, we are collectors, we collect, but I think, you know, this support, this challenge, you know, taking the region to the world, that is yeah. something we enjoy more. You know, this has become something very important for us, we feel, because, you know, our art needs to be in the international art world map, you know? And it's so, their artists are so talented and so good. You know, people just don't know. So, you know, this, the, this event that we have, we mostly target people, I mean, curators to come, gallerists to come, journalists to come. Um, museum institutions to come so you know they can come and see and you know after after the first edition which was we hosted in 2012 and the third edition which is coming up already you know so many Bangladeshi artists are you know being represented by international galleries a lot of uh, big institutions have you know acquired Bangladeshi artworks so I you know this is a success for us and and you know uh Post Dhaka Art Summit 2012, for the first time in the history of Bangladesh, actually, you know, international museums like, you know, Guggenheim, Tate, British Museum, they started collecting, you know, contemporary artists from, uh, works of contemporary artists from Bangladesh.